Let's read all about it. We have some huge news. Huge. If, if you're thinking about moving to the North Texas area, you do not want to miss this video. So stay tuned. I'm Andy. And I'm Patrice. And today we are going over the best places to buy a house in all of the United States. The whole United States? The whole United States. Okay. Wallet Hub did a um, article. They did a whole study. They took a whole bunch of metrics that we're not going to bore you with. We'll link it down in the description <laughs> below as well. But we have exciting freaking news. Mm -hmm, we do. If you're looking to buy a house, Dallas Fort Worth area is by far the best place to buy a house in the entire United States. And we're going to dive into that in just a second. Now, if this is your first time on our channel, we are local real estate agents specializing right here in the Dallas Fort Worth area. Uh, so if that is something that you're interested in and by golly, you should be. <laughs> Uh, make sure you hit that subscribe button, that bell, so you're alerted every time we do a video. And don't forget to give us a call, text, or email. Whatever you got to do to get a hold of us, just get a hold of us. And you can listen to Andy say, by golly, again. By golly. <laughs> That's a first. <laughs> <laughs> so, anyway, we have some exciting news. Wallet Hub did a study, and they took like 18 different metrics. Mm -hmm and examined all this stuff. And like I said, it will be linked below. Patrice will go over some of it. But um, they they ranked cities by large, mid-size, and small. And what um, are those categories? What, what consists of a large city? What do they consider a large city? A large city is considered anything over 300,000 population. Okay, and then what is a mid-size city? That would be like 150 to 300,000. Okay, and then a small is underneath 150,000. Correct. So, exciting freaking news. We're gonna go over the top six, but uh, spoiler alert, the top six, there's only one that is outside of the state of Texas. That's amazing. And it just happens to be the one that we started, we were thinking about, we were about moving, yep. relocating in, um, back in 2006 when we relocated from Southern California, and that is Gilbert, Arizona. So if you want to move outside of the United States or outside of Texas, <laughs> Gilbert, Arizona is the place to be. Mm -hmm. But but if you're looking for the best place to mm -hmm. park some money, invest in real estate, buy a home, etc., then North Texas is the place to be. And I'm going to tell you why, because how many do we have, Patrice, in the top six right here in the Dallas Fort Worth area? We have four. Four out of That's the top six. six. <laughs> I mean, come on. I know. What are you waiting for? I know. Come on. Give come us on. a call, text, email, <laughs> fill out that dream home form below. Let's get you started. Let's yeah. let's get this rodeo going. <laughs> uh, so without further ado, we're going to go over this. Like I said, this is going to be a quick video. This isn't... Uh, or shattering stuff you can read the article as we post it mm -hmm. but just so you know we'll link a video up here of the most recession proof cities um in the entire united states and those also happen to be right here yeah so, <laughs> so. and and wallet hub so check out that link below too as mm -hmm. well um but coming in at number six was what number six is allen allen texas mm -hmm. Right? Number six out of the entire United States of places to buy a house. Mm -hmm. What was number five? That would be Denton. Denton, Texas, yeah. people. Yeah, Denton, Texas. You know, these places are growing. They're growing like <laughs> weeds. Yeah. All right. Then, number four, a city that you guys may have heard of before. Mm -hmm. Good old McKinney. McKinney, mm -hmm. Texas. Number four. Yeah. And then number three is Gilbert. Gilbert. Right? Mm-hmm. Good for Gilbert. Very good for Gilbert, yes. Number two is our <laughs> large city in the south and actually was the number one large city to move to. Yeah, that's Austin. Austin, Texas. Mm -hmm. And then what was the number one place to buy a house in the entire United States? That's that the good old Frisco, Texas. Frisco, Texas, guys. Yes. You did it. Congratulations. Number one, we moved out here to Frisco, Texas. Uh, 15 years ago, and it was the best decision we have made yeah. by far in our entire lives. Um, if you're looking, if you have a family, you're looking for great schools, you know, great job do. opportunities, 
um, just an overall thing to do, everything. Yeah, um, Frisco, Texas has got yeah. it all. I'm telling you right now, you will not be sorry no. by any stretch of the imagination. This whole area is, is growing like crazy. Dallas Fort Worth is going to double in size in the in the next nine years mm -hmm. um, to become the number third market in the entire United States. And here's a sleeper for large cities. If you look and, and you pull up this uh, link, large cities, another one, a uh, little, there's a little bonus session for you, Fort Worth. Mm. Fort Worth is exploding and there's a ton yeah. of growth out there as well. So there's such opportunity. We've got every city's got everything for everybody. And so this is just a, one of those areas that is, it's got something for everyone. And, yeah. and if you're looking for, if you're a young family looking for good schools, all these cities check off all those boxes. If you're a millennial yeah. looking to get your foot in the door and start elevating your career and looking for a place to lay some roots down, Dallas Fort awesome. Worth area is also a great place to do it. Mm -hmm. And absolutely check out Frisco, Texas, as it is, will have more uh, office space per capita than Dallas, Texas. So it's just, it's just a great place to be. Yep. So again, give us a call, text, email, whatever it is that you need to do to get a hold of us. Until the next time, I'm Andy. And I'm Patrice. Take care.